I know. You don't want me to leave. I get it. Three, two, one, go. Welcome to Donkey Romance Part 2. If you followed in the beginning of us trying to get Dolly Blanche knocked up. Bless you, honey. Bless you. We brought in a young Jack named Buck. And we loved Buck. Are you alright? Are we okay? Okay. We brought in Buck. He was young, inexperienced. We gave him a chance and we're not sure that he didn't. We just need to redo this whole thing, honestly. Take two of this of this intro. Episode two of Donkey Romance, and today we are bringing, bless you honey. Today we are bringing Dolly and Blanche a new husband. He will be arriving here in the next 30 minutes or so. And if you watched the first episode, we had a young Jack with them named Buck. And we're just not sure Buck knew what or where to do. Uh, we're not sure that he didn't breed with Dolly because we did see him mounting her and whatnot, but we never saw any connection. So I'm pretty sure he didn't have anything to do with Blanche. So if Dolly is pregnant, Blanche still needs to be bred. And so we brought in the big guns. We brought in a guy who is experienced and you'll get to meet him later. But uh, let me introduce you real quick. Excuse me. But before we get into this romantic episode, let me introduce you to this episode sponsor, which is Hi C Boots. Hi C, Hi Saya. You tell me if you know how to pronounce it. <laughs> so we have about 30 minutes before Dolly Blanche's new husband and his parents arrive. And I figured I'd make them a little flower bouquet because they are staying in our Airbnb for the night. They are graciously bringing him all the way from Ohio. So I didn't want them to have to turn around and just go back home. So they're gonna stay in our Airbnb for the night, hang out a little bit. They're probably gonna meet Poppy and Petunia, but I figured they deserve a little welcome bouquet. Okay, is it better to say that it has, is it better to say that it has a genetic defect or that it has Weimaraner in it? Like Genetic defect, nobody likes Weimaraners. <laughs> I swear to you, they have wine in there. I'd rather have a defective lab than a wine runner. <laughs> it's like his great, 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 great grandma was a wine runner. But then the genetics would show. How do you breed it out? I don't know. Can you spell wine runner? I can't even say it. Wine runner, All I can think about is that movie Juno, where she's like, "Well, I can finally have wine runners." <laughs> <laughs> so while I clip these flowers. Let me tell you a little bit about these high C Hasea boots. These are the upgraded women's rain boots. They come in multiple colors. They have a hundred year warranty. They're super affordable and they're really comfortable. I've been wearing these things around and I have zero complaints. They are easy to put on. They have really good tread on the bottom and this is maybe not going to relate to everyone. But I have really big calves. Like, I've just always had big calves. And it's really hard to find boots for me that fit and are comfortable and don't make me feel like the top of my calves are being like cut off circulation wise. And these are adjustable on the sides and it makes it so comfortable and easy and makes me feel better about wearing these boots over my leggings or whatnot. And it's so much more comfortable. So, if you got big calves like me, that's something to remember. The handsome boy has arrived. I'm so excited. Oh. Can pull down here? I think it's so funny. You just see ears. You just see ears sticking up. You don't see anything else. Yeah, I love that so much. It is way more aggressive. He's the it's, mature he's, white tail. Yes, okay. That's he the best chases, way to put it. Okay. okay. He's going to chase, and he's going to chase them around. Okay. And they're going to kick the crap out of him. Uh-huh. And 
he loves it. Uh-huh. Like, that's what he's here for. Like, the more they kick him, the more excited he gets, uh-huh. the better everything's going to go. Which, so, I, I don't know that Blanche is still in heat. Okay. She was still being mounted, like, by Dolly, yeah. not by, yeah, we, yeah. Didn't have, we haven't had a male in here for a week. But, like, Dolly was still mounting Blanche as of, yeah. like, two days ago. Okay. And I saw her, like, getting on her and peeing on her last night. So, okay. she could still be in heat be today. In okay. yeah. um, but, I mean, it's been going on for, like, a week. Yeah. So, I mean, I don't know if she so, kind of went out um, or. He's never hurt anybody. But, mm-hmm. like, he'll run. Like, they'll chase him. Then he'll turn around and chase them. Mm-hmm. He's very loud. He squeaks when he he calls. He's, like, a squeaky. Mm-hmm. It's hilarious. And he gets very excited to see you. And I brought him an animal cracker. So. And then, yeah, I have some carrots and stuff, too. Um, and then, so, do you, is, has he ever been with, like, goats or anything? I have no idea. Because I'll put my goats up then while we're doing this. Because um, I was going to let him get in this and then share a little fence for yeah, a second. Yeah, just, be fine. That'd and be fine. then, so let me, before we bring him off, yep. let me go put my goats up so yep. that they're protected. <laughs> Hi, Mr. Hank. I like this trailer. Come on, Mr. Hank. You're beautiful. Oh my goodness. It's a little dirty. It's a little rainy. And it's rough. okay. Oh my goodness. Maybe you'll make mine get caught easier. Oh, he's a pain. Mine get once they're caught, they're flat, they're like, okay, we we give in. But like if you're out there and you're not paying attention to him, he comes over and rubs his head on your back. Uh, we did an intro to this video and both of the girls had their chins on my back, uh-huh. like resting on me. <laughs> and you said he's 16? So he just had a birthday, so he's 7. Oh, he's 17. Okay. He just turned 17. Hey, but I mean, in donkey years, that's 10. Yeah, that's That's seven. 8, you and know. Like, that's why I Cut it in half. Like, it's not like I'm riding him. I'm no. driving him. He has not a hard job. And you said he showed? Yeah. What, he did he drive or did he? No, like confirmation. Gotcha. Well, that's, well, there you go. That's awesome. Oh, how long have you had it? Two years. So I have those panels up because like with the, with the little boy, we were like, okay, well maybe we need to separate him. You wouldn't separate him. You would just let him be with him. Well, he knows his job. Yes. Yes. He has no problem. And it's funny because if they're not like completely ready, he'll ignore them. And he gets like, oh, oh, oh goodness. <laughs> it's been a long ride. It's been a long ride. He needed a little roll. Okay, dude. So oh, much for your clean all day. I love him so much. With a more experienced Jack, I don't want y'all to be worried. If they start kicking the crap out of him, that's a good sign. And he's going to love it. It's going to be a little more aggressive than when we had Buck. So I just want to prepare y'all. <laughs> uh, oh, him's got the zoomies in his new pasture. He's going to go smelling around. They're like, where are you going? Why aren't you intrigued by us? Oh, did he find another rolling spot? Oh my goodness. Oh. Blanche. There we goes. He like <laughs> And y'all were worried about him being dirty. And what's great is like, this is my living room right here. So I'm laying there and I can see through the window sometimes like if stuff's happening and it's funny. When they're ready, he, he won't. That's the thing. I, I think Dolly's probably gonna be coming into heat soon. And I think Blanche just went out. So I don't think either one of them is like. You, can know, you know when they're in though. <laughs> they make it very obvious. Yeah. Uh, 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 uh. 
which we can give them some chill time too. We can go take them to the Airbnb and then come back and watch them for a little bit. Oh my gosh. Oh, Blanche. Oh, Blanche. He wants it though. Girlfriend, maybe you're not out of heat. Oh, don't get on Dolly. He's like, oh, you don't want it? I'm going to go over here then. I don't know why I see him having like a German accent, but. Mr. Hank, you got to be here for the outro, buddy. Okay, I don't want to get in the midst of some donkey kicking, but I was told that Mr. Hank likes some booty scratches, so I'll hopefully hold him here with him. But I hope you'll enjoy that. Stay tuned because I believe Dolly and Blanche are not in heat right now, but will be coming back into heat here soon. I think Dolly will be the next one up. So we have that to look forward to, and I'm really excited to share this journey of them hopefully being bred and having babies around this time next year. So if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. If you would like to see more videos, I would appreciate if you subscribed and liked, and I'll see y'all in the next video.